So we're here in the house of Scunthorpe for the launch of the latest not in our community film, Trapped. Really pleased this evening because a lot of the young people who've helped write the script, who've helped with the production, some of them taken on some acting roles, are here tonight, they've brought their family along. Because it's really for them, it's not just like, let's be in a film and it's a media project, it's something that we're hoping to get out into the community to help other young people and the community around them understand more about child exploitation. It's okay saying professionals can, can, can write something and say what we think it looks like in North Lincolnshire, but we're never going to get a true reflection. And, and taking feedback from children and families, they make it real, they make it authentic, they, they know what's happening on the street. It was very emotional for me because uh, we had some our own bad experience. And I think this is very, very important that that sort of projects are being uh, undertaken and then shared with uh, mainly young people. We see that the different forms in which those young people are being exploited it has themes around sexual exploitation, it has themes around criminal exploitation. And within the film there are a number of characters who just come to certain realisations which we're hoping the viewers will come to themselves and really reinforce this message that it's down to everybody within that community to be the eyes and ears to protect young people. To watch it come together like that was incredible. The story it's portraying is the most important thing that needs to grip everybody and I think it's done its job without a shadow of a doubt. I'm really, really proud to be part of such an amazing thing. Really good, really powerful. I think it'll reach a lot of people and I think we should use it in the like, schools and throughout the community. People these days don't realise what you can get into and they just do everything without thinking. So you really have to look at what you do before like doing it. You just have to think twice. I just think it's absolutely amazing, you know, I'm so proud of all the young people uh, that have been involved in the process of, the, of making the film, you know, uh, I was lucky and fortunate enough to, you know, to be involved in, in the kind of de developing of the film uh, and actually, you know, being able to see it on screen and see how the young people, you know, see their reactions as they're watching the film and seeing themselves off screen was just amazing. Well, it's a very powerful uh, piece, of, uh, piece of drama and so realistic as well. I mean, I, as I said earlier, I, I knew that when I stood up and just spoke a few minutes ago that there was no way could my words actually um, sort of uh, give a description of, of, of how I felt. Um, and I know what uh, has been portrayed tonight uh, with the child exploitation uh, as, is, is real. It's happening. I, I know it's happening. I've been, I've been in this, uh, this sort of game for, for quite a few years now, but I've never seen it described as graphically as it was described today on the film. And I would encourage everybody to have a look at it and think very, very hard and long about what they could do to contribute to make this, uh, this world and these children's lives uh, better. The whole production has been um, produced during COVID times. Um, we've had to, you'll see that when you watch the film, some of the considerations we've had to make, but it's great that actually as lockdown starts to ease, we're able to come together and to celebrate the launch of this event and make sure that it's as powerful as it can be. I well, think it's really important because it is, uh, it's uh, not in our community, so we need to use our kids to spread the message, really. It's, just, it's a great opportunity, isn't it? It's good. I liked it, yeah. It was awkward seeing it in person, not like actually seeing it happen, but overall it's really good. I'm really proud and I'm proud of everyone here.